Hi, Sody family. Today we are giving away $1,000 to one of you. We're doing last to leave this video, and throughout this video, there will be letters like this going through the screen. And you have to go through, collect all the letters, unscramble the two words, comment them below, or go to shotoftheayers.com and email it to us, and we will pick a winner. Blake, are you gonna stay in the ball pit forever? I've got an idea for us to pass the time, guys. Marco Polo. No, no. Haha, <laughs> Parker's in. In today's video, we do the last to leave the ball pit wins. But before we get started, give us a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Last to leave, I went in on this. <laughs> Must not have been as deep as he thought it was. Okay guys, we have an awesome ball pit built. And we are gonna see who can stay and hit it the longest. And the winner gets double allowance this week. Yeah! What's the allowance? Guys, I'm sad, I don't get to play. Someone's gotta take it one for the team. All right, guys, so while they're having a fun time in the ball pit and having to stay in the ball pit, I'm going to try my hardest to get them out of the ball pit so that we can see who the winner's gonna be, and I have some tricks up my sleeve. First off, guys, it is 7.20 in the evening, and we haven't eaten dinner yet, and the kids were complaining that they were hungry and wanted to eat dinner. So guess what, guys? I am cooking a delicious casserole, but only those that get out of the ball pit can eat dinner. Guys, who's hungry? Me! Too bad. If you're in the ball pit, you can't eat dinner. I don't want food getting all in those balls. Sorry. No. Uh, that's not good for me. Maybe you should leave the ball pit then, Dad. Maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I should. I think Blake's gonna win. Go. Blake, are you gonna stay in the ball pit forever? I have no idea what she's gonna do with double her allowance. What's double nothing, guys? At least what? it's comfortable to take a nap in. If I sleep the whole time, I'll win. Ball pits are awesome! We'll see how you guys feel about that eight hours from now. Eight hours? Eight hours? Or 30 minutes, we'll see how long they last. Guys, this blackened chicken Alfredo is looking pretty delicious and smelling even better. I've got an idea for us to pass the time, guys. Marco Polo. No, no. Haha, <laughs> Parker's in. Marco? Polo! Marco! Oh. I got you, Jordan. Now you win. Try to get away from me, guys. Marco. Oh. I say whoever gets tagged gets out. No way. Come on, let's make it a little bit risky. Marco. Oh. Oh, 
Can we push people out of the ball pit? I don't think that's okay. I have officially made a rule. A person must willingly leave the ball pit to be counted as out. Yay! All right guys, so I have a good idea to maybe try to weed some of those kids out of the ball pit. So they seem to be getting a little bit bored and so I am going to go in each of their rooms and pick one of their favorite, favorite things and put it on a table in front of them and see if that's enough incentive to get them to leave the ball pit. Hopefully these will be enough reason to get them out of the ball pit. Yeah! Yeah. Guys, they are seriously playing Red Rover. They're having way too much fun in the ball pit. I need to get this stuff downstairs or else they are going to stay in that ball pit all night long. All right, guys. I brought down some of your favorite things, but you must not touch it while you are in the ball pit. Because as soon as you touch them, you're out! <laughs> How do you know? I am the rule maker. And for dad, nice frozen Hershey bar. Are you guys missing some of your belongings? Nope. My daddy! Jordan, this blanket is so soft and warm. And it feels a little hot in here. Let's air it out a little bit. Nice and snowy. Jordan, just needs to get a little bit colder in here. No, there's a bunch of lies. Stop it, don't go. Jordan, see you. I can Jordan. tell that Jordan is the weak link. Jordan, just, just get your blanket real quick. It's cold in here. Yeah, Jordan, it's kind of cold. You should go get your blanket. I am so cold in my blanket to him. I can't stand it. <gasps> no. Oh. One down, a lot more to go. How does it feel not to double your allowance? Mom. Mom, you just a twisted person. Well, does that mean we get our stuff now? No, you don't get your stuff. It's gonna sit there and tempt you guys all night long. Guys, I'm just getting started. I have so many tricks up my sleeve. And one of them involves everyone's favorite drink. Chocolate milk. Thirsty. I am just gonna help myself to a nice big glass of chocolate milk. I'm in a happy place. I'm in a happy place. Hey Jordan, would you like a glass? What? There's a lot of empty glasses here, guys. Why do you want it? Why do you want out, Parker? I want chocolate milk. You want out? Uh, he. Uh, <gasps> Parker, get out of the ball pit! Guys, she is majorly rubbing it in, drinking that chocolate milk. Mom, yeah. Two down! A lot more to go, but I'm doing good. Remember, the last week they fall on the step. Give it to me! Give me! Give me! A little over two minutes and dinner is done, guys! Who's still hungry? I am. Nope, I'm not hungry. How did Parker get back in the ball pit? I jumped in. Doesn't count, guys. She has officially been kicked out of the game, so she can't win double allowance. Blake, are you getting tired of the ball pit? I think she's getting ready to get out. Blake, do you want mama? 
Do you want to come out with mommy? This is just evil. <laughs> mommy will hold you. Do you say baba? You want a baba? Do you want out? You want a drink? Yeah. Come on. Come on out. Oh. No. no, Blake. Blake, how does it feel to officially lose the last to be in the ball pit game? Chopsticks, baby. <laughs> Guys, I have never played this game and I have never gotten it. I have no idea what they're doing. At least they're quiet. I'm glad I left the ball pit. So is Blake. All right guys, I have another trick up my sleeve and I know the perfect way to get Peyton out of the ball pit. I have her homework here. Hey Peyton, guess what I have? Your homework. You wanna come out and do it? Are you tempted? Give it to me. It's homework. Are you serious, Mom? That's the best you got. I'll do my homework after you double my allowance. Wow, I'm so scared. Oh no, homework. Oh no. Wow, don't play me with homework. And Dad hasn't moved his position in the last hour. I just got an idea of how to get Steve out of the ball pit. Who can resist a nice, comfortable pillow when you didn't get a lot of sleep last night and you're stuck in an uncomfortable ball pit? Oh, you're so good, Mom. Steve, look what I have. Daddy, Mommy wants to talk to you. I have your nice, comfy mm. pillow. I had to go to these balls, thank you. It'll be on the table next to your Hershey bar. All you have to do is get out of the ball pit. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Dad? No way. Shoot, I really thought that was gonna work. Guys, I think they're getting a little stir crazy. And Parker is still voluntarily in the ball pit. <laughs> Remember, the minute you touch it, you're out. You're out. Daddy. You're out! <gasps> you're out of the ball pit! You're hungry! He chose the Hershey bar? Well, and dinner looks like it's a couple minutes from being ready. Guys, the Hershey bar is what finally did him in. The Hershey bar, chocolate. Who would have thought? Daddy, you give me I would have thought. All right guys, a little update. It is 8.30 at night. Dinner is ready, we're getting it dished up. It smells delicious, guys. It may not look that good, it smells great. And we still have three kids in the ball pit who are getting hungry. Savage! Mmm, it's so cheesy, so delicious. Girls, are you getting hungry? Mm, yeah, I would use my plate right here. If you get food, you're out of the game. Who wants a tiny taste? Me! Just do it, just do it. Ah! They're holding strong. What do you guys say that after we eat dinner, we go upstairs and play a little bit of Fortnite? Well, wait a sec, don't you guys all like hate Fortnite? Not today we don't. So unfair. I can't stand it anymore. I'm so hungry. Guys, it's coming out. I'll give you one dollar if you leave. Are you coming out? Wait, wait, wait. Is she doing it? She did it. Woohoo. Good luck, guys. It's so much better on the other side. Oh, Steven, this is so good. She got her dinner, her chocolate milk, her homework. And Duncan! Guys, aren't you jealous of Blake's yummy peas? Not really. Aren't you hungry? I could do this all day. I'm on fire! I'm not leaving. 
I'm not leaving. I'm not leaving. Definitely not leaving. Not going to leave. Still not leaving. Still stay here. Haven't changed my mind. Not gonna leave. Yeah, we've 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 covered this. I'm not leaving. Guys, it's 9:30. We haven't eaten dinner and we've been in here for hours. All right, Steven. How about we do a competition to see who gets out of here? Well, you're going to be in here forever. All right, guys, I have the perfect competition. So, Steven is going to try and collect as many of the blue ball pit balls as he can, and Taylor is going to try and click, collect the yellow ones. And they have one minute to try and get the most ball pit balls in their box. And at the end of one minute, we will count and we will see who wins. Whoever wins won the challenge, and whoever loses has to leave the ball pit. Build that box up. Okay. On your mark. Get set. Go! who you guys think won, Steven or Taylor. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seventy-three! Now it's time to see how many I got. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ninety yellow balls! Oh, does that mean the last to leave the Legos for But before we get so started, please big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Hi Sodi family, what's up guys? Um, As you can see, our house is a little different and kind of crazy. Guys, we have 2,500 giant Lego blocks. And it's insane guys. It's crazy. I love Legos. We're gonna surprise the kids and build a giant Lego fort. And then, just to make things interesting and fun, we are going to see who can stay in the Lego fort the longest, and maybe they'll just have a surprise for them, waiting for them if they stay in the longest. Guys, look at all of these. Legos. All right, before we can surprise the kids and do anything, we have to build a fort as fast as we can. Let's build. Guys, after 45 minutes, it is finally built. And it looks awesome. Let's check it out. All right guys, now it is time to go get the kids, surprise them, and then do this awesome challenge. Whoa! 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 Already feels like home. Lego home. Do you guys like your Lego fort? Yeah. It's like the biggest ever made. Guess what? What? You guys have to stay in there. All right, if you cross this threshold, you're out. What? Now guys, you do not have to stay in there, but this is a last to leave the Lego Fort Challenge. So the person that stays in the longest may just get a pretty awesome surprise, but who knows? Who's gonna play? Me! I'm 
playing because I get to have a surprise. Um, she's not even in the Lego fort, guys. Hi! For some reason, this plastic Lego fort makes all of my kids' hair super staticky. It's like sticking up like crazy. My hair's not sta staticky. Lego, help you skate! Come on! Let's go. <laughs> up the window! <laughs> All right, guys, so I have to change the rules. If you cross this, you're out, and if you go out a window, you're out. That means you Blakers. While you guys are spending your time in the Lego fort, we may be giving you guys special things to do while you're in there to pass some time. Thank goodness I'm getting bored. Already? Guys, I'm not out. Guys, Steve is building something complicated and pretty big. Is that gonna go inside the box fort? You gotta have seats for everybody. Seats! He's building chairs! I want you. Um, she's still not inside the Lego fort. Blake, that was a close call. That was a close one. I guess Parker's decided to join the competition. I go in. Are any of you guys wanting to give up yet? No. no. Yeah. She still does not understand this game at all. I have a Lego gift for everybody. Yeah? What is she doing out here? What is that? You get a throne. Yay! Can I have it? Blake, I think you're out of the game. <laughs> oh no! Busted. One thing that I haven't mentioned yet is while the kids are inside the Lego fort, we are going to be doing little challenges and if you lose that challenge, you may just be eliminated from the fort. But the winner of the challenge gets to sit on the Lego throne. Like a boss. Here comes the throne. All right, guys, what I'm most worried about is that these kids are going to want to stay in this Lego fort forever. This competition may never end because this is probably one of the coolest things ever. So, to make this hurry along, we are going to have our first challenge. Paco, put up your legs. What are you guys doing? She's a queen. She, I'm a servant. Queen. Yeah, and I'm queen. a servant. Please do not punish me with more taxes. Parker knows how to work it. She hasn't even won a competition yet. Since Parker's the queen, she doesn't have to participate in this challenge. It'll be a four on four. Um, there's four colors and four of the kids are gonna participate. Winner gets the throne. Then you need to take this little mini tower and turn it into a cube. The last one to do it leaves. All right, does everyone have their block tower? Yeah! This is kind of a hard competition. Let's see how they do. On your mark. Get set, go! How's it going? Pretty good. Uh, wow! This isn't a cute. Wait, this is... My math Oh wrong. no, you're not doing cubes! You did a rectangle! Taylor wins. Here's my cube. Okay, cube. Done. Done? I don't know. I did it wrong, but I did it right. Did it. Oh, but it's not connected. I get it. I get it. I get the rectangle. It's going to be close. Peyton oh, by a hair. Oh, that was so close, but Peyton won. I guess I'm the second person to leave the Lego for it. You and Blake are out. Actually, at least we get our own seats. Ah, this is more like it. Winning pays off sometimes. That doesn't look very comfortable. All right, guys, so we have two gone and four more to go. Are you guys ready for another competition? Yeah. yeah. Ready or not, you're getting one. This is my greatest invention yet. What is it, a toilet? No, it's a seat. It looks like a toilet. It's like that plum. You invented a seat? No, the best seat. I made Parker a special little chair. Look how cute it is. You ready for your chair, Parker? Yeah! I might be having more fun than the kids. He totally is having more fun than the kids. My lady. Wow. 
Ew. Wow. Blake is impressed, but now it is time for the next competition. Hey guys, I just built a robot. His name is Billy Bob Joe. Tag Tommy. <laughs> All right, guys, so we are clearing the Lego fort with all of the kids' little creatures that they built so that we can do the second competition. And guys, look at Steven's little man there. It's pretty awesome. And Dad is testing out the competition. Are you able to do it? It's harder than it looks. All right, so because Taylor was the winner of the last competition, she doesn't have to do this one. So everyone else will be participating and it is a balance beam. Every block has to be stepped on. If someone falls off, they're out. I'm going first. Steven, yeah, you're rock. Blake, is that a good playpen? I had to lock her up. I got this. <laughs> cool. Wow. It's not working. I'm trying to make you got it. I win. Well, I mean, I guess I don't lose. Um, Looks like I need to make it a little harder. We need to come up with um, some harder competitions or we're gonna be here all night. I'm gonna add some layers to this thing. Layers, what does that mean? Try that, kids. Come on, huh? Step off every single block. Blake's blocking the way. No! You have to step up it. I can't do this. <laughs> what are you doing? Watch out. Wow. I did it! Hey, keep going. Uh, Blake? Dad, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Oh, shoot. This is gonna fall. What is happening here? I'm doing it. <laughs> <laughs> well, it looks like Parker is out of the competition. She touched the ground. And there were three left. All right, guys, these guys have been inside the Lego fort for a while now. It's time to bring out the big guns. Time to see how important winning really is with the money. Hey, guys, congratulations on making it to the final three. This is where it gets really tough though. All of you are good at winning competitions, but if one of you chooses to leave right now, I have a reward for you. What? What is it? What is it? Five dollar bill for leaving right now. Thank you. So, do you guys even know what you win if you win the whole game? No. Well, that's funny because I know what you win if you leave right now. Maybe the $5 is better. Why can't you just tell us? That's what makes it even more interesting, guys. But that $5 is not gonna stay around for long. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. No! <gasps> it's mine. She took the $5. Bye. She took the $5. I don't even care about winning. Did she just smell the money? Yes, she did, and she is out of the competition. And then there were two. So are you regretting not taking that $5? Just a little, but okay. At least if I win, I get bragging rights. All right, guys, so before we do the last and final competition, we have one more thing that we may be offering you guys. 
So you guys didn't want the $5, but I think you might want to take this. It's my last cash offer. And it's not $5 this time. It's $1. Are you kidding me? That's worse, not interested. All right guys, so you have a choice to make. $1 or do the final competition. There goes the dollar guys. It's worth more than the real prize. All right, are you guys ready for the final and last competition? Yeah! yeah. All right, each of you guys have 10 colored blocks. The person that can stack all of their 10 blocks up the fastest wins and they win the whole challenge. They will be the last person to leave the Lego fort. On your mark, get set, go. It's gonna be close. Steven's having some problems. Done. Done. Steven's are not stacked together. Oh my God, the stack burned the fastest. And I won the challenge. And as the winner of the Lego fort challenge, you get to pick our next Lego game. What? That's it? I gotta pick the next Lego video? I'm paying up $5? I don't feel like I won. Uh, I don't feel like I lost. You never know what you're gonna win in these competitions. Fine, I'm gonna pick the craziest Lego video ever. Look at Baby Blake! Blake! <laughs> no, Blake! She's the lava monster now. In today's video, we play Last to Leave the Hot Lava. But before we get started, give us a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Hi, Zoe family! As you can see, uh, we're trapped in lava. So we are going to do the Last to Leave wins versus the Lava Monster. That's creepy. We have to stay on our cushion and do not touch the lava. If you touch the lava, you're out. And my job is to get them to leave their rocks. Uh, it's a cushion, Dad. I'm say down. The last to leave the lava starts right now. Wait, you didn't tell us what we win. I need to know what I will win. The winner <gasps> of this challenge gets a night where they control mom and dad. but I'll also have some other cool surprises to get them out of the game. I don't like this prize at all. I do. That's hot. Uh, do we have to sit here all night long? Cause I mean, I'm ready to. I'm gonna win this thing. Oh, Peyton's getting awfully close to the lava. Do you want to get out? No, I'm so at this. Look at me! Blake! <laughs> no, Blake! She's the lava monster now. Blake! We already lost Blake. Are you next? Lava angel. He likes to jump on his belly. But then he'll flip us off on his feet. Yeah, and he'll go on his belly. Uh, the lava monster is making a lava angel. And it's disturbing. All right, kids, what you did not know is this last time, like most of the other ones that we do, are also challenge-based because if we didn't do that, it would just be boring. <laughs> Bring on the first challenge! The first challenge is the forest lava! <laughs> Wait, what, what does that mean? We're already sick. The floor was already lava. Not a good challenge, Lava Monster. But you guys have to go all the way around each cushion without touching the lava. No! Or the Lava Monster. Dun, dun, dun! But he has short legs. I thought you were gonna fall in. No. I have long legs. Then let's go. Which way are we going? Clockwise. Wait, what does that mean? Doesn't mean that way. Elementary, old chap, elementary. These kids apparently need more homework. No, we don't. On your mark, get set, go! That is impressive. I'm not moving. 
Everyone must get back to where they started. What? Cool. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hey, you almost pushed me off. Ah, ah the lava monster! <laughs> That's my my foot. But I'm okay. It would heal. What's the official ruling, Judge? I say that Peyton is safe. Barely. She's lucky that Parker got out. Yes. One last jump and everyone will get back to where they started. One, two, three. Oh! <laughs> I'm so close to touching the lava. The floor is lava dance party. I have another idea to get someone out of my lava pit. You, you, rock, paper, scissors. Ready? Uh -oh. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. I have scissors, I have rock. Peyton is eliminated from this round. Rock, paper, scissors, rock, paper, scissors, shoot. I am the winner! Or are you? Your prize for this round is you get to be bribed. No! What's a bribe? I know Taylor's secrets and what her weakness is. Taylor, all the money in the lava man's wallet. Oh, I might not need it. Oh, how is that? All the money in my wallet is yours if you step into the lava now. I would feel like it again. How much money is there? You only know if you step into the lava. Take my hand. <laughs> Join me. <laughs> Do you have a lot? <laughs> how many did how much did he have? Does it include credit cards? Only if you want my debt. What's debt? This offer expires. In five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> I'm melting. Give me the wallet. Everyone has a price. And Taylor's is? Please don't be just a dollar. One dollar. Two dollars. I only got two dollars. Two lava dollars. They're on fire. Anytime someone leaves, the quicker I get to the prize. It's a lava ball. <laughs> get it? Let's play catch. Catch it! It should be on fire by now. This gives me a really good idea. It's challenge time. I need a timer. Oh no, it's a hot potato. All right guys, the rules for this hot potato game are everyone has to pass the ball around in a circle as the music is playing. Once the music stops, whoever is holding the ball is out of the game. And you can only hold the ball for five seconds at a time. Cue the music. On your mark, get set, go. Looks like you are out of the game. There's just two girls left. Let's see who wins this challenge. Me! Me. Or will it be me? Well, I'm so bored. Me too. Ah. I know. Lava gymnastics. Mm. Let's see this. Oh, I go first one. 
Oh, is she out? No. Oh. Impressive. Impressive, impressive, impressive. Lava monster, lava monster. Yeah. <sighs> impressive, impressive. All right, guys, it is time for that final and last challenge, and hopefully we'll be able to see who the winner of the last to leave the hot lava challenge is. Rock, paper, scissors to see who goes first. Rock, paper, scissors. You win. You're first. You must get from that cushion to that cushion. Remember, don't touch the lava block. Well done, Padawan. All right, Payne, it's your turn. Lava monster. to our channel. All right, is everyone ready to play Last to Leave the Lego School Bus? Yeah! Does everyone have their backpacks? Yeah! Does everyone have their notebooks? Now everyone, get inside the Lego School Bus. Everybody, clap right. Everybody, instructions. All right guys, the rules are simple in this Lego school bus. If you walk out of the school bus doors, you are out. What do we win if you're the last to leave? If you are the last to leave the Lego school bus, you guys get to have school lunch for an entire week. Yay! All right guys, this is a last to leave with challenges, so be ready. Hopefully you're on your A game. The bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round, all through the town. Well guys, I guess while you're waiting for a challenge, you can just work on your homework, I guess. Say what? Guys, you don't have a chance. I can stay in here forever. What the main is Shishaba? What the main is Ting Ting? Does anyone want to do my homework? I'll pay you. Blake, what's three plus two? I'm so glad I packed this candy in my backpack. Speed bump ahead! Ooh. Wow. Wow. Whoa. For your first challenge. Already? 
All right, guys, I have all of your notebooks here. On the first page, you will see that there is a scrambled word. The person to scramble their word last is out of the Lego school bus. And then we don't get school lunch. Dun, dun, dun. On your mark, get set, unscramble! I know it, I know it. Um, Yippee. <gasps> Done! It's math. Wait, are they all school subjects? Because if so, this would be Chinese, but it was not an H. Done! Mine is P-E. That was a close call. You all did so good, but sorry, Taylor. You were the last one to unscramble your word. You must leave the Lego school bus. It looks like this is my stop. Bye, Bye Taylor. Taylor. Guys, our bus is getting emptier and emptier. Things are starting to get real. You out, that hand's out. How do you know? One, two, three. writing these poems from inside a lion. Harry, you're a wizard. All right guys, it is time for the second challenge. So if you guys want to win a week's worth of school lunch, you have to prove that you know how to make home lunch and fast. I know how to make home lunch. Real quick, name your favorite sandwich. PB&J. Nutella. Waffles. Just kidding, peanut butter and honey. The first two people to make their favorite sandwich and then come and get it inside either one of these lunch boxes wins and the person that doesn't get it inside their lunch box has to leave the Lego school bus. <coughs> Nutella, PB&J, and waffles. On your mark, get set, start spreading! Oh, this is gonna be easy comp. Oh, I gotta hurry. I'm just taking my time. I'm a machine. Chocolate's the best. Come on, spread peanut butter. Peanut butter jelly time, peanut butter jelly time. Waffles! Who know making sandwiches is so tough? Can you use a knife for the honey? Make it Come on, honey, come out quicker. I got this. No, I got it. I'm moving on to the peanut butter. I'm already on the peanut butter. Honey, go faster. Peanut Waffles. butter, jelly, Waffles. Peanut butter, Waffles. jelly, peanut butter, jelly, peanut butter, peanut jelly. Butter, Nutella, time. Peanut butter, Nutella, peanut butter. I'm closing. <laughs> I'm up behind you. Come on, honey. I can do this. I got it in. No. <laughs> I got it in. I got it. Done. Done. Uh, my sandwich looks amazing. All right, girls, enjoy your sandwiches because Steven is eliminated from the Lego school bus. I guess this is my stop. Boom. Bye. Uh, this is a big bus for only two people. Soon to be one, if you know what I mean. I'm winning school lunch for a week. No, I am. No, I am. How long have we been here for anyways? Forever! Huge! 
sorry to break up recess, but it is time for your last and final competition so that we can see who the last to leave the Lego school bus really is. It's me! All right, this last challenge is simple. You guys are going to play three rounds of the popular game, Rock, Paper, Scissors. But you're going to be playing it with actual rock, paper, and scissors. Say what? Are you ladies ready? Yes! Ladies, do you have your first choices? Rock, paper, scissors, suit. Oh man. One point for me. Ladies, do you have your second choices? Yeah. yeah. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah! That means I got two points. If okay, I one more point, I win the whole entire thing. Uh, Jordan, that means you won. <gasps> yeah! I guess it's time for my stop. Bye, Peyton. Just so you're my best friend. Uh, guys. Prize ever. The question for the day is, what's your favorite school lunch? The last to escape loses. No! Hey, Sodi family! So we just got locked in an escape room. And we are competing against Uncle Dylan and Steven Yeager's channel. The channel that escapes first gets to... Control the No, we want to win, Parker. All right, guys, the escape room has officially started and we are competing against the two other channels, guys. We need to find clues fast and escape out of this room. You guys are lost in here. After you watch this video, make sure to watch the Uncle David's channel and Steven Yeager's. To see their escape rooms and the clues that they were given. All right, everyone, scour this room for clues. Did you add one? What? Because Thing over there said Gizmo. Guys, Gizmo. Gizmo. And that's what we named the robot dog. And Where I was found, that? And number two. The card was right here. <gasps> Ready, Guys, so we named this little dog Gizmo. I can't believe that that's where one of our clues were. Okay, guys, there's another um note that says good night, sweetheart. Good night. The crib. Okay, search in the crib. That would make sense. What the hell? Lucy, what is it? It's a three. Yeah. It's <gasps> three hot. Okay, guys, we need to look at all of the other papers. Strongest shape. Strongest shape. What is the strongest shape? Uh, guys, I have heard somewhere that the triangle is the strongest shape. This? So what does that mean? This one says remember me. What does that mean? Remember me. What is that song off of? Where have I heard that before? Coco! Coco! Oh, no. Do we have the movie? Yeah. Okay, I know we had it in the car. Do you have it? Open it, open it. Open it. Guys, I found it. Should we just open it? Yeah, yeah go ahead. Let's just see what Let's it is. Crayons. Let me see. Crayons. But guys, Crayons. maybe it's What blue. colors are they? They are yellow, blue, blue orange, orange um, red, and pink, and, and purple. purple. All right, so the only thing that we haven't figured out is strongest shape. I don't really know. Anything? I'm so confused. All right, guys. I just Googled it. It says, thus, a triangular shape is the strongest one, which is also called a rigid structure. So How did I notice triangular this, Triangular shape. How did I notice this? What? <laughs> well, guys, Where this, was that? This right here. Oh. Oh. I was spinning oh. on this. I it's a triangle. Oh, I literally moved this. That's one. crazy. Okay, well, we happened upon it by accident, but it is a triangle. <laughs> guys, I think we found all the clues. Guys, but why do we have a box of crayons? All right, guys, so here are the cards that we found. We have a lock here, but what order do we Let's do it Let's try in? every order. All right, so we have the diamond shape, we have the a clover, the heart. We the have diamond. every shape that we need on the lock. What do you guys think? I think we should start with the youngest number. 
two, three, four, eight. So there was one here, one here, one here, and one here. Guys, we didn't keep track of which ones we found and in what order. Oops. Okay, guys, I just thinking really hard. This is the order we found them in. Okay, we found them in this order. Okay, so pay in, do four of the clovers at it's the top. This one. Two, three, four. Do three of the hearts. One, two, three. Do one of the spades. One. Now do two of the diamonds. One, two. Did it work? No. Guys, I can hear on the other end that Steven and Uncle Derek have gotten out of their room and they are continuing on in the escape room and we are still stuck in this room because these cards don't make sense. Oh man. Derek, is that you? How are you guys doing in there? Stop it, stop taunting us, go away. Me and Steven are home free out here. We're exploring. You guys are just stuck in this door. No fun, good job. All right guys, so we've been sitting here for a really long time and um, I think we may have figured it out. I think it was simple. Instead of doing like one, one, two, one, two, three, and four of each thing, um, Jordan had the idea of just doing one of each thing. One. Then what's next? Diamond. Two. Diamond. Okay. And then three. heart. Three. And then four. Clover. Clover. Okay, let's see. <gasps> Parker, do you got the crayons? Let's do this. Yeah! That's not good. Took you guys long enough. Wait, Have wait. you even solved anything? Welcome to our world where we don't know what's going on out here. All right, we found a paper that says choose your path wisely. All right, guys. So it says that if we escape through the wrong path and door, we will be eliminated. But what does that mean? What are paths? These look like paths. Okay, so there's a red flag with a red lock. Of, and a blue flag and a blue rock. Here are the yellow ones. So how do we know which path we're going through? That's a good question. Neither do I. Well, this is by the paper, guys. Oh my goodness, that's a crazy combination lock. Things are getting intense. All right, guys. So obviously we were the last group to get to this part of the escape room and some of the clues have already been picked through. So it's only fair if Uncle Derek's channel and Steven Yeager's channel shares some of the clues that they have found. So when I was in there, I got some crayons. Don't know what they're for. We got crayons too. I also got crayons. I also have two batteries and a yellow key. We don't have any of that. I found a yellow paper that says Steven, so I think my path is yellow. Um, all I found was a B. Same. Bath. Same. Day. Also half. Your. I don't have your. And it's. And a battery. That's blue. It's your bath day. That doesn't make any sense. It's your B day. Secret. I don't I, I didn't hear a word you said. Oh get it out! So Steven, let me see your cards. Are so, they in yellow? Yes. So Taylor, his cards are in yellow. Derek, your cards are what color? Blue. <gasps> Blue. Oh that must be red! Or there's a missing papers that haven't been gotten, so we gotta and find red papers maybe? I don't totally know that blue is mine. I just chose it because I like blue. Hmm. We need to find a path and those red papers. I think we need to solve this riddle first, and then we move on to the next. And I think that will tell us what path we're supposed to go on. All right, guys, we did all get crayons, and guys, we got six. There are six letters that we have to solve on this little contraption, and Peyton had a pretty good idea in the room. We could put it in rainbow. These are the letters of the crayons. Does that make a word? Maybe the first letter of all the colors makes a word. We're trying to be quiet so we don't give it away. I think we need to write colors in it. Okay, so she's gonna write in colors. Do you want to spell it? C O. Wait, so we start with C O L L. Oh, 
Which one do we want? What colors do they show? Oh no, it says blue, red, and yellow. Let's do what? Which one are we? We're doing blue. That means we are blue. All right, we are gonna be very quiet. We now know that we are looking for the blue color and we can't say it to anyone because they may be going down the wrong path. So everyone, zip your lips, lock it, key in your pocket. All right, guys, follow me. All right, guys, we are looking everywhere for all of the blue papers around the house. Okay, we have look out the what and what did I see. We have a B, we have a your, we have a bath, and we have an it's. It's saying look at the window and what did I see. Guys, check out this window. Check this window. Quick, hurry. You see anything? Hurry, pull it. Nothing. Anything? Oh, what is it? We got it's a battery. This one has a blue one. Wait. Blue battery? Yeah, we Does that one have a blue guys, one? Guys, guys, we found we both, both of them. them. Guys, we just found two batteries. There's a blue one right here with a long two. There's blue stuff everywhere. What does this mean? There's a yellow one. See ya! Say no! I win! Let's go! Let's go! Yes! I've escaped the escape room. I did it! See ya! Guys, Steven just escaped the escape room and then right after Uncle Derek. So that means they got first and second place and Shot of the Jaegers got last. We don't care, we're gonna solve our escape room anyways. That's the spirit, girl power, we can do this. Got another card. Say, Jay. Like I said a minute ago, it's your B day. It's your B day. Back. I think we need to go upstairs to the blue lock up there. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Who's birthday do we do? Oh, There's lots of people. Mom's! That's Mom. right. That's your order to Okay, let's do mine. What's yours? Okay, seven. The top. Seven. Twenty-four. Two, four. Two. Hey, put this three numbers so. Seven, two, four. Okay, let's see. It just unlocked. Did it work? <gasps> oh, let's go in. Let's see. Guys, the back. What? Um, Hava comes from pain. Guys, look what I found. Whoa. What is it? It's a tracker. A tracker? It's a metal detector. What are we trying to detect? Metal. It doesn't work. Why did I turn it on? Okay, is it not working? What is this? It's not working? It's this low. Power, guys. What battery! Is, the battery that we had! We now have a Guys, here's the battery. Give me the metal. Let's see if we can get it in. I don't know. Do you guys see where it will go? What? Do you hear this? Down there? I don't. I. This is what I have to work with. This is why we're best buds. Put them on. Oh, you think that's where you put them on. Okay, so put one in and we're gonna connect them. What do we do with this? Turn it on and let's see if we can find anything. <laughs> what, I'm gonna make it so it's easier. Over there. Guys, you had a clue that said bath. We should go to the bathroom. Okay, go to the bathroom, Jordan. Let's see if it's in there. Another key? Yes, key. That's key. What? That key. Oh my gosh, this is the last one that we have to do. Okay, take it, hurry and unlock it, time to get out. Yeah! Okay, hurry, Taylor. We gotta get out. We gotta get out. Put it in. The last to escape 
loses. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm doing a last sleep escape room challenge. But before I get into this awesome adventure, remember, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and give me a big thumbs up. Well, I may it may seem like I'm the only one in here, but Derek's in one room, my family channel's in the other room, and we are going to go and race each other out of this house. And I've got to figure out how to get out of this first walk. Yeah, that's not gonna work. I don't know why I'm pounding on the door. Let's get looking. Well, that was easy. Crayons. I have red, yellow, blue, red, green, blue. Well, I've got a handful of crayons. I'm not sure what they are yet, so let's keep looking. For some reason, I doubt that something's in here at all, so. But you know, you gotta look everywhere. Well, nothing up there. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, this is disgusting. I smell my socks. That doesn't smell good. Wait. Four of hearts. It's a weird four of hearts. I mean, it's pink, so. Maybe that does something with it? Okay. What are these signs? R2D2 who? Monsters live where? I X marks the spot like father, like son. Do I open this? Many find everything that's on here. R2 D2 Who? Um, monsters live here? Would that be this? X marks the spot. X marks the spot. Okay, maybe I look around a little more. Maybe there's something else not in my closet. So my goal is obviously to get off this door. Wait. Wait a sec. These are normal. That's diamond heart. This place is a clover. I mean, four. Ah, I need to look for more cards. One card. Crayons. Monsters live where? Swamps? Ponds? R2D2 who? The robot? And then X marks the spot. Like father like son, I feel like it's something that me and my dad both do, but I don't know what that would be. Football maybe? Gonna keep looking around. I don't want to rip that off. It's too beautiful. Okay. That did not just happen. No. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Two. Wait. Maybe, just saying, because my dad isn't too much into Star Wars, he meant this is R2-D2. It's BB-8, Dad. Okay, I'm gonna pass the where monsters live and X marks the spot for now. I'm gonna move on to, like, father, like, son. Maybe basketball? I don't think so. We both, we both like fishing, but it's not really one thing that we both do very often. Um, you know what, I'm just gonna go looking around the place like crazy. Monsters live in my dirty laundry. Smelly monsters. Card! Okay. 
Okay, this is the three, so, so I have a, so far I have a, a four, a two, and a three. I need the one, I have everything but the one. I think this was like father like son, because I like razor rising and he likes razor riding, so that should be one, but what does X mark the spot for? Maybe there's like a map somewhere. Like treasure. Treasure, 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 treasure. Um, maybe there's something in here. Wait, there is. I just didn't see it. Okay, so diamond. All right, I think I'll be able to get out, but I feel like there's more to it than this. I think this is the combination to this, because this has all four houses of cards. So I think it goes diamond up down. I'm free, I'm free, I'm free, I'm free, I'm free. Oh, I'm free, I'm free, I'm free, okay. I think we should go now. Oh wait, I dropped the crayon. We'll keep these cards in handy. Choose your path. Choose your path wisely. If you escape through the wrong path and door, you will be eliminated. If you use a clue from another path to help escape, be eliminated. It's a box. Looks like I'm the first one out of the room. Shh. Whoa. What does this have to do anything with? Wait, I also see some other weird stuff. A red banner. It's locked with three numbers. There's a blue one over here and a yellow one over there. I think I have to get into one of these. Wait, uh, no. Day. Day, 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 day. So, choose your path wisely. If you escape through the wrong path and door, you will be eliminated. If you use a clue from another path to help escape, eliminated. What path am I? I have to choose a path wisely, but this only gives me a couple of options. It gives me yellow, green, red, and blue. That's all colors on here. So maybe, so I think I need to open this and find a key to one of these things. And I think if I open this and I find the key, that's the path that I should choose. So maybe I explore the house a little more and hopefully find a good clue. Wait, wait a sec. It's happy and the. Some batteries, different colors. I think Derek just got out. Let's see what's going on. Hey, hey, Derek, did you escape? Maybe. Did you? Well, I mean, I can just tell. I then why did you ask me if I escaped? Okay, okay, look, okay. I don't know. Because this is what I got out of the, that box that you're holding right now. Is crayons. Yeah, I got crayons too. Oh, you got cards? Those... Stop looking at my cards. Okay, here, here's the secret, those cards, were the cards to help me open that door, so it has probably nothing else to do with that. Huh? You'll go on without your cards, and maybe I'll, I'll win because you. I have cards. I'll try to well, help what does this mean, Steven? I don't know. Have you opened the box yet? Oh. I think we need to solve. Choose your path wisely. Because there's three colors um, on each door: blue, red, and yellow. So are we supposed to choose one of the colors? That's what I'm thinking. There's a ton of blue, ye yellow, and red things all over the place. I got out, so I'm still just looking. I have no clue. <laughs> so Derek's out, but the shot of the Eggers is still suck. I think I'm gonna go for this blue battery. A few more things. Steven. Wait, in yellow. What's this one? This one says your, and this one says world. Maybe I should go for yellow. Maybe I take yellow, put this back, and 
I move on to. I think the girls escaped. Let's go. There's one way out. It's yellow, so I think I have to get out of this door. What if Derek goes in the wrong door and gets in the Two. That's red, though. I don't know which door is for what. Maybe there's something. Stuffed animals. Jackets. I don't see anything. So, ooh, day. I saw a blue day earlier. So I think I have to find all the yellow ones, put all the yellow clues together, and they have to get all the other co colors. But I don't want them to know that, so shh. Wait, this is a little odd. No, nothing. Oh, B, 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 I don't want, I don't get it. Maybe, I mean, I see these locks here, but I have to get a key to get a key. And I think that key gets me completely out. And I haven't even gone into some of the rooms up there, so I think I need to go for blue. Hmm, nothing down there. That's weird. I don't think anything's in here. Maybe I should go over there. Oh, what Derek just was. Hey, hey Derek. I Steven, need... move. I gotta get over here. I know, I did. Steven, I, I gotta get over, over here. Another blue one. Okay. Yellow. This is yours. Yellow, yellow, yellow. Okay, okay, that's good, that's good. It's... <laughs> Oh, yes, 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 yes. Blue battery in there. This is bath. I'm gonna go to the bath. I guess. Let's go! To the bath! Is it this bath or is it the bath that's locked upstairs? I think it's the one bath locked upstairs. That one color's not yellow. So the bath, here I'm gonna, so I have two batteries, Danny, B, Steven, and bath. It's Steven bath. Wait, B day. So B day, I have a school, which is an A day and a B day. So I'm gonna keep this there, batteries, Steven, and bath. There's got to be something in here. I'm gonna go check the showers. I don't see anything in here. What the heck? Wait. How? No. Wait, did I actually just see that? Or am I just going crazy? Like, what is going on? Okay. I think this key goes to, I want to say the yellow door, or the front door. My yellow key case, which I think, I feel like that key in there would lead to the yellow door because otherwise, if this led there, that would just be there for no reason. This is even assuming that I'm actually on the right path with yellow. Why are you going down the yellow path? I mean, I just guessed yellow, but this says Steven. I went for blue, but then I saw this. Wait, happy, I forgot about this. Excuse me, Derek? Do you have a word that says happy? No. Yes, I do. Uh, There's one, two, three, four, five, six letters. This is happy, one, two, three, four, five. Steven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. B, one. Day, three. Bath, four. Uh, I think these batteries have something to do with it. Good. Took you guys long enough. Wait, have you even solved anything? Welcome to our world where we don't know what's going on out here. Yeah. Wait, is this yours? So I have found those crayons. They haven't done any good to me. The batteries. 
in the cards, but I use the cards. B day. Your B day. Birthday. That means birthday. birthday. Guys, you can't. Guys, you can't give it away to them. Birthday, birthday, birthday. <laughs> Thank you so much. Mine also has a B day, except it says Stephen Happy B day. Happy B day. Happy B day. Okay. Um, I need to try this key on a couple of things real quick. Do you guys think I should dare unlock this? Okay. Wait a second. What if I'm not actually yellow? Do I risk it? I think this key opens the main door, but I'm a little really, really worried about that. Okay, over. Maybe I should look around a little more. What's another? Lock I've seen. Oh, I'm really worried. I'm really worried. Another battery. Is this even the right key? It is. But do I risk it? Do I not risk it? Risk it for the biscuit. If I go through this door, there's no coming back. What if I just solve this puzzle for somebody else? Guys, do, do I do this? Do I go and just risk it all to go out there? Or do I go and try to find that combination? There's also that yellow door upstairs that I never unlocked. But what, 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 what? Numbers. I think I know the combination. Oh, come on, come on, come on. I think my combination is 622 because my birthday is June 22nd. You didn't hear a word I just said, Derek. It worked! It worked! What the heck? Derek, excuse me. Looked out the dot, 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 and what did I see? Hey. Yes, this is my name. Yes, the combination was my birthday, but I still don't know. And I don't have any idea what this could be. I don't know how to turn it on or anything. Wait, this is yellow. I found all of this stuff. Two batteries. Wait a sec. Oh my gosh. Is this actually happening right now? So I found a metal detector and batteries that go with it, but I don't know if I even need it because I unlocked the last door. I bet this was supposed to help me find the key under the mat. I looked out the window and what did I see? I found the thing that says bath. Oh my gosh, I think I've done it. I think I've finished. I just don't know if this is really my color or not. Let, I'll see if anyone's found another puzzle yet. Derek, what did you find in there? Uh, all the information I needed. I'll let you guys solve that later. We're out of here. Derek is putting everything back. I don't think he's actually blue. What if I'm blue? I have to get that code. The girls still have it. They're taking forever. How's the first one out and last one to get this clue? So, I've unlocked the yellow door completely. There's no lock on it anymore. But I don't know if it's fine. Can I have some advice? That's risky. Derek, I know you know what color I need to be, so can you please tell me? If I were you, I'd go out the yellow door. Now I gotta go find my red paper. No, no, Derek, 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 no! I don't know if I do this or not. I don't know if I do this or not. I really need that combination. I really need to run up there, get that thing, open it, and then I can know exactly what I am. What if I unlock this door and someone else walks out and wins? So I need to get that combination. Did you guys crack it already? Yeah. Yes. I mean, the girls are pretty loud, so I kind of heard what they said. <laughs> it's color. So, if I can find, oh my gosh, this is so hard. Okay, okay. C, O, C, O, stop, no, Derek. Derek. against time. Ooh. The girls are 
using all my Ooh. stuff. Power comes from pain. Ooh, the window pane. That's where I got my batteries. There's not that it's not opening. Can you help me? I, I it's not opening. What the heck? It's on the it's on color it spells color, but I can't open it. Jerk! Is this how you spell color? C O L O U R? Or is it U L U R? Sounds right to me. But then why is it not opening? <laughs> this is urgent. I'm crying. <laughs> I'm trying to put color in because the girl said it was color. But color's not six letters. Wait, is it colors? Before we get started, make sure you subscribe to my channel and give me a big thumbs up. The last to escape loses. Okay, we just started. It's my channel against the Shot of the Jaegers channel and Steven's channel. So, just looking around, we got an X on this pillow. I'm not sure exactly what this is going to mean. Maybe it's X marks the spot. Three of diamonds. Let's keep this over here. <laughs> what is happening in the other room? I hear a bunch of shaking. Okay, over here it looks like we have some signs. It's great to be eight. Dot 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 Y and Z. Write him, cowboy. And I must ask you a question. And over here we had an X. Maybe X goes with Y and Z. We have a little treasure chest here. I'm so sorry. Crayons? What am I supposed to do with crayons? Okay, we got all different colors of crayons. Hopefully, oh, there's another one. Hopefully this means something later on. Looking around. Hmm. The light is on. Someone's been here. I don't know what I'm supposed to be looking for. One of the piggy banks is upside down. Oh. That's just because there's holes in the feet. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I don't understand. What am I supposed to be looking for? The pogo stick. Soccer ball. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, there's a lock on the door. It says diamond, spades, heart, and clubs. There's gotta be more cards in here. Oh, there's a card in there. 
mind blown. Look, I found this one under the X, and it goes with this. This one says, ride him cowboy. This card was underneath the horse. Hmm. It's great to be eight. There's an eight. So Taylor got baptized when she was eight. So maybe there's a card inside of her baptism book. I knew it. So we got a four of spades. Okay. So it looks like we got an ace, three, and a four. It looks like that's the order maybe they go in for the lock, like aces first. We still gotta find a two, and then there's three and four, and these all match the lock. So now all I need to do is find one more card, it's the two. Okay, so the last one is, I must ask you a question. So I'm looking for a mustache somewhere. There's gotta be a mustache in here somewhere. Let's look around Taylor's bed. Nope. Jordan? The blankets? Huh. There's gotta be something in here. We looked all out there. And we haven't found anything in here. The light was on, so I think there has to be something in here. What do you guys think? Comment down below if you have any idea what I mustache you a question is. Because I have no clue. It sounds like Steven's out of his room already. I better hurry, they're already out. I gotta find that last card. I may have figured it out. While I was rustling around, making a mess of things, I looked up. These hats have mustaches on them. How did I miss that? Of course. The first one I pick up has the card. Okay. Okay, we got our order. Let's go see if the lock unlocks. Okay, the first one is ace of clubs. Two of hearts, three of diamonds, four of spades. The door, it is open. <laughs> um, I don't know what the crayons are for. Maybe I'll just bring it with me. Steven did get out. But it sounds like the shot of the Jaegers are still stuck inside. We're in second place. Choose your path wisely. Hey, Derek, did you escape? Maybe. Did you? Well, I mean, I can just tell. Then why'd you ask me if I escaped? Okay, okay, okay. I don't know. Um, do you have any idea what this could possibly mean? Because this is what I got out of that box that you're holding right now. It's cramps. Yeah, I got cramps too. Oh, you got cards? Those... Stop looking at my cards. Okay, here. Here's a secret. Those cards were the cards to help me open that door, so it has probably nothing to do with that. Ah, huh. you'll go on without your cards, and maybe I'll, I'll win because you. I have cards. I'll try well, to... What does this mean, Steven? I don't know. I'm not going to box yet. No? It's some weird combination thing. Oh. I think we need to solve. Choose your path wisely. Because there's three colors um, on each door. Blue, red, and yellow. So are we supposed to choose one of the colors? That's what I'm thinking. There's a ton of blue, red, and yellow, and red things all over the place. So up here, we've got doors with different colors on them, and they all have locks on them. With three numbers on each lock. I don't know which door is for what, and which one I'm supposed to go to. How are you guys doing in there? Me and Steven are home free out here. We're exploring. You guys are just stuck in this drawer.
There's papers down here. One's blue, one's yellow, and one's red. I think it goes with the doors. Maybe I just choose the color and I go with it. Oh, there's batteries too. It looks like Steven chose yellow. It says choose your path wisely. What does that mean? I'm choosing blue. Now, I guess I gotta figure out how do I get into the blue door. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna gather up all the blue papers. See how it goes. A battery. lock upstairs, see if I can come up with anything. No, I am gonna do that. <laughs> That's not good. Took you guys long enough? Have, Have you even solved, solved anything? Welcome to our world where we don't know what's going on out here. Yeah. I don't know. said that my color is red. I gotta go find all the red things. Found my battery. Another one. Found my other battery. Derek, 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 Derek. So, I unlocked the yellow door completely. There's no lock in there. I don't know the time. Can I ask some advice? That's risky. Ooh. How much do you got? What do you mean? Advice comes with a price. Derek, I know you know what color I need to be, so can you please tell me? What's your favorite color? Am I blue? If I were you, I'd go out the yellow door. Now I gotta go find my red paper. No, no, there, 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 no! It says, welcome to the world. Would it be my birthday, like no. Stevens? Mm -hmm. Gotta go! It's like a race against time! Ooh. Girls are using all my Ooh. stuff. Power. Comes from pain. Ooh, the window pane. That's where I got my batteries. Oh, it's so color, but I can't open it. Oh, Steven. Sure. 
Is this how you spell color? C O L O U R? Or is it U L U R? Sounds right to me. But then why is it not opening? So that clue said bathroom. Hopefully I can find it in here. Look at that. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go! Oh, yeah! Mm -hmm. Let's what? Go. Oh, yeah! Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> we got the key! Oh, shoot! I think we're home free! Yeah. All right, guys, we escaped. Even though we were the last team to do it, I guess that means that Steven gets to control our day. Oh, no. Thanks for watching today's video. The question for the day is, what was the hardest clue we had to solve? Subscribe to my channel.